Yo guys, and welcome to a new game that I'm going to be doing a series on. This is called Life is Strange. I know this is quite an old game now, but I got it because I got given a £5 gift card on, on it by Xbox. I saw this, it was like £4 for the whole season, and I thought, you know what, let's buy it, because I'm pretty sure I can do a video on this. So yeah, I have been wanting to play this game, but now I've got the finally got the chance to. gonna be quite a long video will be let's say like half an hour I'm pretty sure if you like these longer videos then hit the like button I do like doing them I love telltale games Not walking dead you um oh what's it called Guardians of the Galaxy is out. Oh, mate. I'm going to play that one. That's sick. Where the hell am I? Holy shit! Go on, either though. Oh god. Whoa. Oh, this dream. So surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. Oh what? My control went off. Just sec, sorry about that. But he could be talking about Back on now. as he likely was. Okay. These I'm in class. Oh my god, just let me sort my controller out just a sec. Things cool. I am okay. My controller's back now. Just have to go get some new batteries. To Kiroskiro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in I black and I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why are- Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Arbus. Hmm. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted so, by the eyes of those sad mothers. Guys, as you know, I did have another series on um. I can't believe I what was it? Murder soul suspect, and I've had to stop that because basically I recorded. Sorry about that, me talking, but I recorded a lot of clips, nearly complete game, and all of that clips, they all corrupted. Basically, I've just had to get rid of the series, and I'm sorry if you like that, but. <clears throat> capture you what another series for you? I'll oh, shut up talking now anyway. I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. Selfie. What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height? I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. 
your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I don't know. You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Okay. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. That talk very good, Victoria. The oh, 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 so funny. Brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Oh, sorry. Damn it. Victoria does. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Mm. Oh, sh Competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so hmm. this might make a cool shot. Know, Mr. Jefferson, I just worked so hard on the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just really think Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating, by putting yourself out there in the world. Now, no matter who wins, every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. To feel excluded mm. from this process, but I also want to excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal, Max. You're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Okay, then. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. You Welcome always to the cute. real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special Anyone picture. Class. I feel like you have to pass some sort of test it's because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. Cards, he plays it so <laughs> sharp. I need to that see guy if doing. I'm out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Look <laughs> that class. It's so fucking boring. Okay. She's so fucking shy. With a giant camera. Nice and quiet. Life is strange. It really is. I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello Jack, kiss kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous as usual. Imagine a world without you. Imagine
That's Dana talking to, I think his name is Justin. Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. Poor Daniel, he's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. It looks like she's been gone for months. They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. Girls in the movies. No one can tell where your heart is. American girls like Dolly. Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. Would still be someone in. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. Why'd she do that? I don't know why she did that. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Butterfly. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Oh, yeah. Where's our man? It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. Oh I'm God. so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Oh, God. Whoa. What? what the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that Of a dream. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. As he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to Back in time. From color Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer I cannot believe who this. captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Diana. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? <laughs> Rewind time. Then my camera won't be broken. Can you give me I an actually example did of a photographer it. who perfectly captured the human, human time machine? machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, Diana. don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, of Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers in When I took my selfie, Jefferson so asked me a question. Tortured, right? Take if the selfie. Does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. 
a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Portrait has been popular I can since tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl Sorry. isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save that her? The portraiture has always been a vital um, aspect of our photography. I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. Wow. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again process, and give him the right answer? Find detail in people's fate. I can rewind faster. Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Daguerre. Daguerrean process. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still Max, I see you pretending yes, not to see me. I see you pretending not to see me. I already heard it. You are not crazy. You are not dreaming. Well, let's go. It's let's go and save her. Everyday hero. I go. Yes. yes. Oh God, let me see that. You still have to do your I see you, Max Caulfield. Oh wow. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. What? Do you want? I'd never let one of photography's future stars of. Back off. I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding. Just. Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Yeah. Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Mm. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Do I need to go give him the right answer, I guess? Yes, Victoria, you still- Where you go now? I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't okay, we can't. John Lennon. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Yeah, I'm just Make sure good. Working on it Too smart. I have faith. Definitely not going back in time. I'll do that. Alright, we can go. See if we can go save her. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. Run. I can't Old tell Artie. anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. They will. You know I don't tease. I hate that science class with those nerds. Bathroom. Okay, Max. Retrace every step. I washed my face. Yes. I shredded my photo. Then the... Butterfly took a picture, went. took a picture of the butterfly, and, photo. and then the guy came in. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck I am, or who you're messing around with! We need to stop this now, how do we, how do we stop doing? him? Come on, put that Never. thing down! Oh, don't fire bell! I need so a hammer to break it open! To oh, move this, move you this! There's a hammer, there's a hammer, there's a hammer! Nobody would ever even get the, man, your punk get, ass get the hammer. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, what? Holy 
Holy shit. I didn't do it in time. If I can go back time again, I can help her. Uh. We are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever what? even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! I did it. I did it in time. No way. That was Don't close. Never touch me again, freak! Another shitty day. Hmm. That did not happen. You saved her. This cannot be real. I now just let's get out. Girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use Sorry. the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Yeah. Scrub. I thank you. The head teacher. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm. I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be upfront with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Oh God. Sorry, part of my hide the truth. Oh, sorry. I think I'm gonna report him. I just saw Nathan. And that's the right thing to do. Waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is serious charge I'll look into the matter personally thank you for bringing me please, to my please just, he's got a gun that's it after what I told we'll you? continue this discussion later in my office please go outside with the rest hey of the class now Miss Caulfield of course this academic wild. drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now the main campus we're in now Wait. Thank you. Busted. I bet the Blackwell founders would shit cats if they saw today's student body walking around like. I better read Warren's text before he blows my phone up. Who's Warren? Uh, boyfriend or okay I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive friend where's my dorm A dormitory. Warren's waiting for me and his flash drive in the parking lot, so I better nope. get back to my dorm. I guess not. Squirrel. God, could have killed it.
I'm not sure where I'm going. I... Is it over here? I think it might. Hello. Oh. Hello. How do you do? Ivan? Ah, here we are. Dormitories. The dormitories. Come on, Logan, bring it, bruh. Bruh, bring it, bruh. Come on, bruh, bruh. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Let's do that then. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Yeah. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely but even say you, that. You said it I before. Guess your meds filled. <laughs> if I hadn't said it, you would have said it, so. Back off. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. No. We ain't moving. Would we'll just beat them up, please. Oh wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get Shame to you. out of my way. I only supposed to move them. I don't want to mess up that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. I Thanks could so. crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Where do we? Ah, water pump. Here we go. What the hell? Oh, hey. Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Nice. I rude. I right, know that. Oh, they're still in the way. Do you understand English? Get lost. Do you understand English? Right, okay. Get lost. You just said that. Oh, I see. Do you understand English? Right, okay, stop saying that, please. Shut up. Okay. Now if I can get paint on them, how do I drop this paint? Find out. What the heck? Reverse time, just a sec. Okay, I think I got this now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn on the water pump. Which will sprinkle them. Hit that. And then they'll have moved. And then I'm going to quickly tamper with the paint. And then it'll f hopefully it should fall on them. Okay, let's see if this works. Hey! Victoria? Oh, Sam. Karma. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Alright, guys. <laughs> That's why I'm going to end this video, guys. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. If you did like this video, make sure to go hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Thank you, guys. Bye.